Hello YouTube, this is Crosscheck and welcome to another update from the Microsoft Flight Simulator team. The team starts this update by reminding us that it has now been over a year since they announced the new Flight Simulator. And as of today, we are just over a month away from the official release. Of course, work does not end with the release. They will keep working closely with the community in order to keep improving the simulator for years to come. As always, we are getting lots of new pretty pictures by alpha testers. I will be displaying them on the background as I jump into the news. Let's now talk about the upcoming closed beta. It seems that today, alpha testers have been granted early access to the closed beta build and I will have to check that on my own. I really want to see what is going on in this uh, beta build. I think it's, it's gonna be really interesting. Sadly, the NDA is still on effect, so I will not be able to comment or upload any of the footage from it. Closed beta is still tracking to be released for accepted non-alpha testers on the 30th of this month. Invitations will not be sent before the 23rd of this month, so hang in tight if you are waiting for one of those. Okay, now it's time to talk about something quite interesting. The team has revealed a feature in the simulator called the Marketplace Partner Program. What this means is that the Fly Simulator will include a built-in marketplace where you will be able to buy third-party content. Of course, these third-party developers must be approved by the Fly Simulator team in order to sell their content directly to the simmers via the marketplace. If you are a content developer, be sure to hit them up as they are looking for all types of quality content. They are accepting applications as from today, so make sure to be quick as to be one of the first partners to sell your content in the marketplace. If you are interested in this, there is more info on the link in this video's description. Moving on, we got some news regarding the SDK. In case you didn't know, some third-party developers have been somewhat frustrated with the new Flight Simulator's SDK. Mostly because of the lack of documentation, the Flight Simulator team is responding by improving the documentation in several areas such as the living world, airport services, jetways, ground vehicles in airports and simvars. They added a new sample demonstrating the addition of custom jetways. They also added the full source of the Diamond DA-62 aircraft as a complex example that third-party developers can inspect and learn from. Also, the sound team has been releasing video tutorials on the addition of aircraft sounds and they are working on more video tutorials in new different areas. Hopefully all of this will water away the frustrations some developers have been having. We got a new development roadmap preview, so let's check that one out. As mentioned, it shows today at the closed beta preview releases to alpha testers and everything else we already talked about. So let's skip all that. In one week, they will be announcing another partnership and we will be getting a new feedback snapshot which focuses on the last alpha, that being the alpha numero 5. On July 30th, the closed beta is officially released to those lucky enough to get invitations and we are also getting another partnership series release. We are actually going to have partnership series released three times in August and twice in September. I am now going to focus more on a couple of things that catch my eye. For example, we are getting a new feature discovery series episode in late August, yet to be announced what it is going to be about. That is very interesting. Of course, prior to that, mid-August we will be witnessing the official launch of the simulator and oh boy, that is going to be quite interesting. Jumping into early September, there is a mention of a teaser. What will they be teasing us on? VR maybe? More aircraft? What could it be? What do you think could be hiding behind that teaser? Then in the middle of that month, they are going to be launching a new series called World Update Series. The episode name is still to be announced, but if I were to guess, this is going to be the way the team will be letting us know what they are working on improving and how. That does sound quite interesting. And yep, that is pretty much it. That is uh, what we can be expecting from the team on the next couple of months. Lots of stuff will be happening most definitely. Finally, the time is almost upon us. Can't wait to see how the release goes and what are the thoughts of all you guys about the new flight simulator. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the news. Be sure to leave a like if so. Want to take this opportunity to thank my Patreons, Punda, Lovra Vegeta, Eastern Hops, Devin Cotting, Ron Miller, and Flaming Didrikson. That is all from me for today. Happy flying, stay safe, cross check out.